Okay, know your tools. Uh, first up, let's talk about strippers. So, um, got plenty of strippers to choose from here. Let's uh, look at these first two options. Um, so these are combo strippers and uh, crimpers. Um, this one here is primarily a crimper and it's probably not even worth talking about when it comes to uh, stripping strip wire uh, because just registration is pretty bad uh, when on the stripper side of it. If you want like uh, a primary stripper tool that actually allows you crimping options as well. Uh, this is a Gardner Bender and uh, you can pick this up for like 20 to 25 bucks. But uh, yeah, this is, um, this gives you plenty of stripping action and uh, it is a little bit tough at times to uh, pull through, but uh, that's, that's what you get um, going for the low end. But uh, we've got some more options here. Uh, this is an Erwin uh, Vice Grips. It's got, um, it's a one-handed stripper, so basically all you need to do is, uh, don't need to hold your the other end of your wire with a, uh, pliers or anything. You just one hand, and they don't really like to, uh, play nice sometimes. You gotta hold down on the one end. But, uh, it's a little bit easier, uh, especially... Um, since you don't have to necessarily have that strong of hands or, or whatever, but, uh, your other option here is to go with one of these guys. This is a, uh, look at that, strip master, and we can find our gauge of wire that we want to strip, and that comes off real easy. So this one's, uh, about 40 bucks. 41 bucks. Uh, you can find one online. Uh, just yeah, Google Stripmaster, and here it pops up. So um, this is a Waytech 556, and uh, this one's pretty interesting. It actually has a little knife there that you can see. It pulls the knife uh, close to the insulation. You can change the depth of the knife uh, by using the. Uh, <coughs> the uh, thing there <laughs> and uh, what, all you need to do is if you've ever stripped these uh, kinds of insulated wire before you know you have to use like a utility knife or an exacto knife and you tend to nick the inner insulation here but uh, with this Waytech stripper all you do go around like that hole and perfect. Haven't nicked any of the insulation on the inside. And uh, yeah, you're good to go. Let me you take your, your other guy. And well, maybe this guy. And go from there. So if you want to invest uh, a little bit more money, that Waytech uh, stripper is about uh, 55 bucks. Uh, it's also great for like the, the larger gauge um, insulated wire uh, where you, you're not going going to uh, cut a whole lot of the, the copper strands for like welding wire or whatever. But uh, there you go, know your tools. If uh, This guy will save you a lot of time if you have to make a lot of cable assemblies. So yeah, these two guys are pretty good. Uh, this guy actually, uh, this will strip up to, I think I've done six gauge wire before with it. This one has limitation, um, so you can only go to 10, from 10, 10 gauge to 20 gauge. So this one is cheaper, um, it's a little bit harder to work with, but it accommodates more, more uh, range of gauge wire. So there you go, what do you think? Um, Got a lot of wire strip. I hope that helped you. But uh, till next time, know your tools.